My name is Sarah Ozeki. I am a hurdler and triple jumper for the women's track and field team, and my major is nutritional biochem and metabolism. I really like, uh, I feel like there's kind of a debate between if you like ting or twink or twing. Um, I personally like twing better. I think that it's a bit quieter than twing or tink. It's, um, I feel like tink is a little too busy. So I like, like the calmness that twing has and there's some good sunlight during the day to do work. And there's also an event called Twing Tuesday where there's like, um, some caterers that come to, um, that are brought into twing, um, through like a student group and they serve dinner for free. So it's a good way to get free dinner sometimes too. I really love the nutrition department at Case. I think it's a hidden gem here. And um, I think that more people should take nutrition classes even if they're not in the major because the professors are great. Um, one class that I took um, was, or I guess it was two classes because it was um, one was in the fall and was in the spring, um, but with Dr. Uh, Stephanie Harris in the nutrition department. Um, I took nu nutrition, human nutrition one and two with her. She's just super knowledgeable and I was just always impressed and like inspired by like everything that all the knowledge that she brought to class, like all of like even the her clinical experiences that she shared with us in class. Um, I was just always blown away by like how much she knew off the top of her head. And um, yes, she's definitely a professor I look up to. I chose Case because for me, they were generous with aid and scholarship, and it also seemed like a good place for like being a pre-med, and I wanted to be in a place where I was kind of with students that had like some more goals and passions, and I think that would kind of inspire me to like go after my own like um, goals, and I was just kind of excited to get into the medical field in the greater Cleveland area as well. So that's why I chose crew. I feel like it's hard to narrow down to like one memory, but I really enjoy like the bus rides to conference meets and then back. Um, they're really long and they can be tough sometimes, but I think like when we all end up in like kind of a delirious state, we're all just like playing games and having like good conversations. And I think a lot of good memories come from that. Um, we always play like telestrations and people draw some ridiculous things. And I always leave with some like pretty good memories from those bus rides. So I do a few things um, outside of the classroom. Uh, I am involved in research. I have been since sophomore year. Um, we're working on a clinical study for that um, with actually great powder and the effects on inflammatory bowel disease. So that has been interesting uh, to get involved with. Um, I am also involved with like Rainbow Connects um, through university hospitals. And I really like this program because it's a social needs program and it helps address kind of like the social determinants of health um, at the like Rainbow Center for Women and Children. It's right down in Midtown and um, I volunteer for them and I talk to patients um, and families and help connect them with kind of like resources related to like anything from like food insecurity, housing, um, utility assistance, uh, rent assist or yeah, rent assistance as well. And so um, through that, like, I feel like it's been very like fulfilling for me to like kind of like help families in ways that um, are important to health, but like not directly medical related. And so that's something that I've um, been really excited to like be a part of um, this past year.